we've told you about how homes across central PA may contain lead. And now a couple in Lancaster is questioning their home after an at-home lead test. CBS 21's TJ Anthony reports from Lancaster with more on this story. Yeah, so the Lancaster couple tells me they've lived in the same home for a little over five years. They say when they did an at-home lead test, it came back positive. And so we contacted the landlord. They said that's just all the old you know, apartments in the city, and if you don't like it, you can get out. Joe Blauberg says last year when they did the at-home test and found out there could possibly be lead, he was still in grad school working a part-time job while his wife was pregnant. Picking up and leaving was not an option. And so fast forward about 14 months now, my baby's about a year old, so it's a couple weeks shy from a year old, and she tested for elevated blood level. And now the baby's blood is, is, has lead in it. We spoke to the property managers over the phone who say there has been no EPA certified testing conducted at this property that found any lead. They also told us the city requires dust wipe sampling, and they say those wipes only test the surface which could have led in the loose dust particles that built up or other high friction surfaces. Joe says his wife's blood was tested and no lead was found. EPA and HUD requires that any landlord or seller of a property, if there's known lead hazards or any history, that actually has to be disclosed to the prospective, the buyer or uh, tenant. Craig Walt with the city of Lancaster says the city requires all rental housing that was built before 1978 obtain lead safe certification or go through the city's lead hazard evaluation. Older housing is is much more likely to have some level of lead based paint in the, in the home. He goes on to say you can live in a home safely that has lead based paint in it. It becomes a concern when it's deteriorated, chipping or peeling or on a high friction service. Joe says he's looking to move his family out of their current home. If you believe that you do live somewhere with lead, then you can contact the city of Lancaster and submit an application to their lead hazard control program. For now, in Lancaster, TJ Anthony, CBS 21 News.